Now, the Taraba state government has urgently requested the federal government's help in providing a floating bridge after the Namnai Bridge collapsed on the Jalingo Wukari Highway, disrupting transportation between northern and southern Nigeria. Deputy Governor Aminu Abdullahi Al Kali, representing the Governor Abu Kefes, assessed the damage and learned from the federal control of works that the bridge is irreparable due to high water levels. The Deputy Governor announced plans to collaborate with the federal government to establish a temporary floating bridge. Gaso local government chairman Abubakar Osman Saidu expressed his sorrow and pledged to ensure sufficient canoes and motorboat are available for transportation in the area. Uh, we are going to put this together to ensure that uh, this bridge is repaired in the shortest possible time so that uh, the people buying the bridge will not, find will not find it difficult in doing that. You know, this road is a road that links the north and the south. And it must come back to be in order in a very short time. So uh, we want them to assist also in, in ensuring that all is done in a very good time so that we just get the bridge fixed so that uh, our, this problem is solved. The level of damage is now is very really apparent. It is when the water subsided, and then we are seeing the beams and the, and the piers that total, and then we see what is underneath, even if it happened, the pile and the pile caps, so that then we can actually determine what is really went from. But for now, it's just too apparent because water level has not surpassed, so that we can see those elements of the bridges that were destroyed. What we are reaching here, I realize it's not an ordinary washout. Two bridge spans got washed. So this is a major project that requires proper construction, not just maintenance. So what is required at the moment is an alternative route for, for cars, while a proper construction will have to commence. Early at 6 o'clock this morning, I was here with the community leaders. We make sure that there have not been any commotion within uh, uh, what has happened. And as you can see, I'm with His Excellency, the Deputy Governor, and the Commissioner. That's the effort we can make to make sure that things have been done and the government came into the head. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.